joining me, we do have a Banyana Banyana player, and that is Hilda Makaya. Hilda, thank you so much for joining me. Yes, not the result you would have wanted, but let's just get the overall assessment over the two legs in uh, with the opponents, Brazil. Thank you. Um, I think uh, it's a learning curve for us. As much as we lost the game, there is a lot to learn from those three games. So I believe going forward, we would know what to do and what not to do. So getting this, such games, uh, Brazil, best team in the world, I think, ranked number 10. So it's, it's a learning curve for us. Let's talk about it because you're alluding to it being a learning curve. We're seeing just the vast difference in terms of performance, in terms of even little things that they were doing right and just Banyana Banyana were not getting right. I think more than anything else, they were capitalizing their chances and we couldn't do that. So seeing that, I think we can go back and work on that and also being complacent on the ball. So yeah, those are the two, the two things that I think we can work on and be able to succeed in the next coming friendly games. I, I uh, counted about two opportunities uh, that you had. I think it was uh, the crosses to Jermaine Siapasunia that were then intercepted by the goalkeeper. Do you think in that area we need a bit more pace? Because opportunities will come. We just need to be lethal in front of goal. I think it's about weighing my crosses as well because I think I played more forward where Jamin was a bit uh, back. It's not about the pace but uh, controlling of the ball and also the pass because the, the field is slippery. So as soon as you put in a cross, it just, as soon as it bounces and then it goes away. Let's look at the mood in camp. Yes, ahead of two big encounters, friendlies, but as you were saying, these are Copa American champions you know you look at the level the level was evident for everyone to see um for me i could say we're getting there with the level of our play brazil has played and the way we're playing as well we had very very good moments and i think if we continue playing that like this we will overcome them one day has the mind shifted already from becoming african queens to now thinking world cup bound Yes, definitely. Now the focus is on World Cup, even though individually we have to go back and work so that we can raise our hands for a coach to pick us again. It's not like we made the team already as we played the friendly against Brazil, so we're still going to go back and work on the teams. But the mind, for me personally, has already shifted from being a champion to preparing for the World Cup. We can hear the loud songs that are coming through from the fans. How does it make you feel that after a result like this, South Africans have, stay, have stayed behind to spur the team on, to sing. Yes, not the result they would have hoped for, but they're still here rallying behind Banyana Banyana. I think more than anything else, uh, they're always behind us. So I think seeing them singing like this, it encourages us even though we lost. I think they still believe in us and we can still make them proud.